Hey there, so today we have another review and this is from Grassroots Brewing or Hill Farmstead. This is Convivial Suarez. So uh, Dan Suarez was actually number one or number two, the one of the first employees at uh, Hill Farmstead and now he's moved on to Suarez Family Brewery uh, with, along with his wife, uh, Taylor Suarez, and now they are considered one of the greatest uh, breweries on the East Coast, but this is an older recipe. It's been a while since I've had this beer. This is a farmstead ale uh, brewed with hibiscus and lemon. So let's dig into this one. It actually comes with a different label now because they describe it as it holding many qualities that they hold dearly, juiciness, acidity, mixed fermentation, and an essence that captures the imagination. Let's dig into this one. Hibiscus definitely drives through on this one. Has a pinkish hue, uh, that purple, purplish thing that um, hibiscus does. Fluffy white head, medium haze on there. Let's get the aroma. <laughs> Sean Hill's mixed culture is just insane. Oh, wow. I mean, it, it, it's. It's Hill Farmstead. It has a little bit of wetness to it. There is some hay driving in there. There's a little bit of acidity, hint of that Saison funk, but not too intense. Definitely leading back on esters, a little bit more phenolic. A little bit of spice driving in the background, but really not super fruit forward that some Saisons can drive or not overly phenolic. That acidity just blends so well with the saison culture that he has in there. <sighs> smells amazing. Cheers. <sighs> Whenever you drink a beer like this, you feel like you've always made a mistake going up to Hill Farmstead and only buying so much of this beer or any of his beers. This beer is $10 and you can go to breweries and only buy so much because you want to keep the IPA fresh and you can possibly find some beers back at home that can replicate it. You maybe have a local hazy brewery doing something like that. Maybe you have a local brewery that's doing great lager, great Pilsner. You're not going to find a brewery. There's no way I can find a brewery other than Suarez if there's Suarez bottles on the shelf that can replicate the flavor profile and the world-classness of this beer, of all Sean Hill's farmstead beers. My God, there's just this medium touch of acidity driving in there. It's a little, again, a little bit wet, a little bit minerality comes in. The fruitiness of the hibiscus plays with this little bit of blood orange character. The lemon is complementing that acidity, not quite obviously, but there is a little bit of drive of zestiness that hits a little past the mid palate. Dries out quite nicely, a little bit of like touch of earthy hot bitterness. The impact of flavor up front is one that leaves you thinking. There is just that beautiful richness of the acidity, the saison culture, the phenolics driving in there, the little bit of grain and malt that's uh, hitting around a little bit of light. Light chewy, light dough and grain character, and the sweetness of the hibiscus comes in. The acidity attacks. The lemon zest ends up accentuating that. Excuse me. Um, just, it's, it, it's so much to think about and so much to taste, and it's something you want to keep going back for because as it warms up, I, I assure you the flavors are going to develop in a different way, and the levels of what you're tasting now um, will change, and I mean, This was not immediately early on to be one of my favorite of the Hill Farmstead, uh, Farmstead Ales, as he calls them. But this has definitely gotten to a place where it's up there for me. It's absolutely insane. This is an everyday beer. I mean, and, and the acidity is still there, but and, and at times it feel you sort of feel it on the way down, but the dryness of it and its 
subtle restraint, if that makes any sense. It, it shows on the palate and it shows on the way down, but somehow it doesn't have to be too much and you still want to drink more of it that is still quenching. Um, I mean, Sean Hill is just the mastermind artist of the brewing community. It's unreal what he can do with beer. And this the improvement on this beer, I imagine, is where it's at right now. And I, I, I'm lost for words. This beer is getting a 99 for me. 99, this is uh, Convivial Suarez uh, from Hill Farmstead, Grassroots Brewing. Until next time, cheers. I'm humbled by the experience of how good this beer is. Until next time, cheers. Later.